Elections in the U.S. are a mess. Right now, there are people and organizations trying to stop you from voting and stop your vote from being counted accurately. That's un-American, and we can't let them get their way. When they deregister voters, we need to re-register them. When they pass laws that you have to have a photo ID to vote, we have to work to change those laws and help people get the ID they need in the meantime. When they decrease the number of polling places, we need to expose their racist and power hoarding tactics, get more polling places open, and get the option to vote by mail or drop off our paper ballots. When they try to force us to vote on computers that can be programmed to produce false results, we fight back. We push for hand-marked paper ballots. We organize communities to keep an eye on the election so they can be as safe and secure as possible. We're scrutineers. We fight to protect the voters, and we fight to protect the votes. The news of the last few years has raised people's awareness of foreign interference in our elections. But not enough people know that the problems go far beyond foreign interference. The very systems we use to count our votes are vulnerable to manipulation by hackers, election staffers, and even the corrupt and partisan voting system vendors themselves. It's easy to think there's nothing we can do about it. But the truth is, there's lots. In fact, it's going to take a fairness force of thousands of us to protect the election this fall. Many of us will be able to do that work from home, online. Scrutineers is training people to be part of that fairness force. Those who came before us fought for the right to vote. Join us to protect that right. Every day you're impacted by the decisions of the government. Join us to help make sure we're actually choosing our leaders. If you care about the future of democracy, join us. Join us at scrutineers.org.